we are. We got uh, we got a Yoshi up against a Diddy. Or is he playing Fox? He's playing Diddy. All right, we got a Yoshi up against a Diddy. We'll have to see where this one goes. Quickly into the grab. Doesn't make uh, the proper combo off of that. Gets his banana back, looking for a play off of it. Doesn't make anything of it, though. Gets a good uh, ledge cancel. Great use of that. Forward air. Here we go. Up throw. Back air. Another bunch of percent. Zach really going in. Banana on the ground. Oh. Well, we'll get up. Firefly just using the uh, super armor of his double jump to get through that. Um, oh, what, what? What were those barrels? They were facing left and flew right. Somebody clip that, please. Put the Illuminati music against it, or the X-Files music, and then put Illuminati signs everywhere. Um, Because that's obviously what caused it, the Illuminati. Oh, wow. Uses the egg to uh, pop away the banana. Get some in a grab. Uh, Zach doing a good job of controlling the stage here. Has a huge percent lead built up because of it. Tries to find the normal get up with the banana. Not gonna reach or not gonna work though as Firefly opted to jump. Down throw. Oh, that's gonna give him. No, he was looking for a jab up smash, I think. I can't think of anything else he would have gone for. Oh, went for the B reverse on the uh, egg lay. Not gonna work. Catches him. Oh, catches the banana with a forward air. Good use. Egg. Oh, gets himself back up. Back air. Up. No, back throw. Interesting. Up throw. No way! Stage level up air gonna kill. I guess he was at a fairly high percent. But I was just shocked that he caught him with it, honestly. Zach still able to kill at this point. Forward air. Egg's coming out. Forward throw. No, there's not enough percent there for that. Oh, air dodge catches that and eats a back air for his troubles. Zach back with the banana in hand. But Firefly with the lead. Forward throw. Here we go. Jace in the background uh, audibly upset about losing a match of sorts. So the banana again. Gets him with it. Oh, tries to go for a falling neutral air. I literally know of no thing that, uh, I don't know of anything that combos from neutral air for Diddy. I've been told it's kind of a mean nothing move. Whoa! And to forward, or into dash attack, I'm not sure. I don't think uh, up smash would have killed yet. So, uh, probably the best call. Oh, reaches for an up smash of his own. Up smash of fireflies, though, will kill. And that will be game one, uh, going over to Firefly. Oh, here we go. Uh, betting close, betting pools close, Exodia. Whenever a good Link appears, people really start to question how good he is. Although well, that can be for most characters, but Link is pretty strong. Ella Wood is a good Link. He is, I guess that's, yes, that's Espeon. Who will our star be tonight? jump and immediately land. Yoshi had a DJC wave, la wave dash? Is that what I'm hearing? Huh. Okay, so apparently in Brawl, um, other links like T and Scizor are more aggressive. Okay. Uh, okay, um, so apparently what I just heard is in Brawl, uh, there was like an awkward wave dash that you could do with... Um, With, with Yoshi's double jump. So that's cool. I'd do that. Looking through the tags right now, trying to find something. Not sure what we're actually searching for here, but searching for something. Gonna switch to Meta Knight. Gonna see the Meta Knight switch. Nope, gonna stay Diddy Kong. He did play very, very well against, uh... Did I break my finger last night? 
Um, did play very well against the Yoshi. There uh, wasn't exactly a, a huge... Oh, jeez. I was going to say there wasn't a huge issue that he had, but he is... Uh, he did get worked there for the first few seconds. Man, this is going to be a quick match if they're going to keep playing like this. Back air. Goes for the grab. Gets a grab. Back air again. Back air. Huge, huge uh, percent trades here. We're not even 30 seconds into this match, and these two are just flying at each other. Whoa. Reaching for more back airs. Uh, Zach, huge amounts of aggression. Flips in. Oh, no. Zach going to try and play in the air a little bit here. Cirque du Soleil coming through. No. Back thrown off the stage. Looking for... No, he doesn't drop the banana. He always holds it in hand. I don't agree with that. There's... I can't come up with a good reason to keep it in hand anymore with what I've seen from Zero and how just detrimental he is with... Whoa! Just with how mentally detrimental he is to players when he takes away all those options. Reverse Nair, though, coming through. Whoa! Catch with the up air, not going to be enough. And Firefly flying his way back in. Gets the grab, back throw, that will kill. Okay, T Kong, banana in hand. Trying to find his way through. Grabs banana, and it's gone. Now, Zach doing a good job of being very aggressive here, playing with his uh, added hit stun and knockback from Rage. <gasps> oh, really reaching for that down air. Would have been huge had he got that. Oh, no, a down air. Oh. Not even going to try and recover. He was already out his jump. Firefly. He's given the free ledge as Zach tried to punish him with the banana. I think he was trying to up throw it to cover stage area, but did not do that quick enough. Down tilts, up throw, back air. Great, great combo coming out there. Whoa. Jeez. Firefly. Looking extremely strong, even though Zack continuously gets the percent lead and continuously finds his way in, he always seems to be on the back foot. And it's not just him playing defensive, it is honestly just him playing scared. Uh, and I'm not sure if that's necessary uh, with the lead that he has. Now it might be a little bit with Yoshi having banana in hand. Um, but up throw? No, down throw. Back air coming out from Diddy. Down tilt, up smash, that will do it. And that'll be game two going over to Zach. Um, I haven't played with him, but he's ranked near me on Anthers recently. I have games with him. Not many Yoshis use Dare Meteor to edge guard, but Firefly uses it really well. It's good for racking up percent. I check my phone. So it was a strong play. Uh, kind of, there was a strong bit of play coming out there from um, Zach to bring himself back into this set. Uh, he certainly needed that uh, that win, otherwise he was going to be in way too detrimental of a position to be able to come back uh, mentally and just stock wise or uh, set wise. That yeah, still seems big. <sighs> was live. Oh, whatever. Uh, so here we are going into game three between Zack and Firefly. Uh, Zack, or I don't know, Firefly dragging him all the way back to uh, Town City once more. Uh, we're going to have to see how uh, who can benefit from this more. Um, Diddy Kong does have up smash allowing uh, the, the banana to up smash kill. So that does allow that to kill that little bit earlier. Uh, and it certainly benefits him. Um, Firefly maybe likes the platforms. Yoshi does kill with up smash and up air, so it's not like uh, it's a terrible stage for him. And there's pretty short uh, walls to it. Um, so, you know, his F smash kill as Yoshi is certainly always there. Gets him with a down air. Good bit of percent. Gets him with a nair. Oh, man! Good use of all of his tools right there to be able to find that stock. Zach, though, sitting on banana, gets the down tilt, goes for the down smash right after. Doesn't quite connect, but he ends up giving, uh, giving him the foot. Lands on it. Wow. Is able to immediately shield? I don't exactly understand what happened there. I guess... Oh, because he... 
No, he landed on it. That's not hitting it in the air. That's landing on it. Whatever the case, he was not put into enough... Uh, he didn't get put into the trip animation, and Zack able to up air through um, the damage he took after getting out of the egg. Tosses out the banana. Gets it with the down air. Banana now in Firefly's hand. Dangerous proposition here as... Uh, yeah, Zack needs to pull out the banana and throw it away, but he needs to... Jeez. Not give it over to Firefly, allowing him to kill him. That's a wrap. Wow. That was a minute 30 of pure action. And uh, it's going to be the game going over to uh, Firefly. Who will our star be tonight? Um, Firefly coming out very, very strong there. Uh, really, really shutting it down. Um, it just didn't... Didn't seem like Zack had much room to breathe. Going to be going back to Diddy. Not going to switch over to Fox. Not going to switch to the Meta Knight. Uh, we're going to have to see... We're going to have to see where he can go with this Diddy Kong. Going to take it over to Dreamland. I'm not sure... Um, wh what he wants to be able to do with this stage in specific. Maybe he wants to take advantage of, uh, of the wind. Although I think he loses the ability to trip, uh, people in certain situations. Um, in the middle of the stage because of the, uh, the angle of the, of the stage. Um, the stage is not built properly, so there's actually kind of a V right, at, right in the middle, right at, uh, around where Wispy's, um, rightmost root is. We'll have to see if that uh, plays into Zack's banana play in any way, shape, or form. It's out of forward air. It's out of back air. He's really able to connect these aerials, and he's slowed down this game a ton. By this time in the last game, he'd already lost his stock. Finding mm. his way back down. Monkey flips his way in. Oh, uses the barrels uh, to kind of bring himself out. Up smash. Not going to do it. This is a lower ceiling than most. It's 180-some units. Um, so it will allow for upward uh, kill power to be uh, strongly exploited. Forward throw? Not quite. Walks the egg with a peanut. Back air. Will he challenge him off stage? No, he's just going to try and trap, uh, force a certain recovery with peanuts. Should have probably dropped the mana somewhere. Back air? Not going to do it. Firefly keeping himself alive. Zack, though, with all the pressure in the world. Mm, banana gone. Nope, banana fully gone now. Egg. Oh, doesn't eat much of a down air. Good job there. Uh, I don't know what Clang there. I guess a was it up air? I guess it was an up air. Just based on positioning of the characters. Uh, oh, doesn't turn around how he'd probably want. And wow, air dodges through that up air and cleans it up with one of his own. Runs himself away. Looks for the banana. Not able to make it in. Zack doing a great job of finding space right now. Creating space almost. Where there, uh, where there just shouldn't be. He's at 144%. The man is on fire at the moment. He's been doing a great job uh, in this game alone. Um, just playing a little bit better defensively. Not, not playing defensive, but when he has to go on the defensive side of things. Just working it well. His out of shield options are way cleaner from what I've been able to see. Um, and his use of the banana has been really good. Okay, a little bit of a bad pull on that one, which is unfortunate, but it will not be the death of his uh, tournament. He's at, he's got Firefly at 72%. For it to be the death of, the, ugh, what will be the death of his tournament is if he's not able to uh, convert with the lead that he's built himself. He cannot afford to uh, hand Firefly bananas. Um, this is uh, Zack's match to lose. Oh no, does not walk up fast enough. Falling down air, giving the banana to Firefly. This is similar to Captain L and Cantrip's match in that um, Zack cannot afford to trade percent. He needs to find ways to just go in extremely safely. He, in, if, if he is going to trade, it needs to be fa extremely favorable and it needs to be that Firefly initiated said trade, and this was like his only option. Defense is Zack's friend, 
by a long shot right now. 124 to 53%. Down tilt, up smash. No, doesn't get the right hitbox. Or it doesn't get enough of the hitboxes, um, but misses the, the one that would allow it to link into all of the others. Oh, falls down with the Nair. Eats an egg, gets himself through. Monkey Flip doing a great bit of work to be able to keep himself alive. Banana throws it off stage. Back air, not going to seal it. Throw it down. Come on, just place the banana. There you go. Control that area of the stage. There, no, leave it. Control the area. Back air. He was DIing out. He was trying to avoid. Almost dies for it. Throws it away. Uh, hold the space. Yeah, there you go. Look at you. Use the banana's wind pressure. The wind pressure with the banana being able to put it so far out and allow it to encroach for, or encroach for you is a huge advantage as Diddy as you're able to just control. No. That's a wrap. Oh no, up air. Um, it allows him to control more space without actually having to move around himself. You can SDI up into the last hit if you react in time. I think that's in 